Hello and welcome to NYU Shanghai. My name is Juan Roldan, and I'm one of the admissions counselors here. I've been a member of this incredible community since 2017, and I'm very excited to tell you all about it. My goal today is to give you an overview of what it's like to study at NYU Shanghai, located in one of the largest and most exciting cities in the world. But before we start, I think it is important to recognize that all of our lives have been disrupted by the COVID-19 pandemic. And more than anything, we hope you and your loved ones are safe and healthy. The college admissions process can be stressful by itself. The added stress of dealing with COVID-19 makes it all the more difficult. Because of this, I want to reassure you that we are fully committed to guiding students through any difficult circumstances caused by COVID or any other challenges they face. Before delving into NYU Shanghai, I think it's important to talk about our overall context within the NYU Global Network. As an NYU Shanghai student, you are an NYU student, which means that you get to share in the same incredible legacy of this school. Since NYU's founding in 1831, we have been at the forefront of creativity and innovation in the world of higher education. From our commitment to bringing in students from all walks of life, we have developed a sense of inclusivity that spans borders and time zones. In fact, this sense of inclusivity has carried forward into the 21st century with the founding of two degree granting campuses abroad in which students can spend most of their college years as NYU students, but in a different cultural set setting. In all of our campuses, we strive to create a community where students can be free to be themselves, as well as being able to engage in discussions around the most pressing social issues of our time. The first of these new campuses was founded in 2010 in Abu Dhabi in the United Arab Emirates. The idea was to establish a small liberal arts school in the Middle East where we could bring students from all over the world to share ideas and perspectives. Following NYU Abu Dhabi's amazing success, NYU worked to further carry this global commitment to China by transforming NYU Shanghai from a study away site to a full degree granting campus where we welcomed our first class in 2013 with 295 students from 37 different countries. Shanghai is one of the largest and most exciting cities in the world and a major global center of culture and commerce. Shanghai is also a great representation of the amazing development China has undergone in the last 50 years. From a mostly agrarian society to a rapidly industrializing one, China retains its roots and traditions while embracing a modern globalized world. Just like many other cities in China, Shanghai has modernized at an incredible pace in the last 30 years, which allows its residents to benefit from an eclectic mix of cultures, architecture styles, and countless cuisines. We are partnered with the Chinese Ministry of Education, which allows us to grant both an US and Chinese university degree to all graduating students. This special status is also reflected in our student body in which half the students are coming from all over China and the other half is international coming from all over the world. This special mix of students also speaks to the mutual commitment of creating strong bonds and understanding between students from China, the US and also the rest of the world. We know moving to China can seem scary, but NYU Shanghai will support you before you even arrive. You will meet your orientation ambassador, other first year students, and your academic advisor during the summer. When you finally arrive, the bonds that are formed through our unique student body start from day one in our residence halls. This is where communities and lifelong friendships are truly formed. Housing is guaranteed all four years and first year Chinese students and non-Chinese students room together. Students are required to live in on campus housing for their first two years at NYU Shanghai. Each room comes with amenities like beds, desks, chairs, and closets for each roommate. Each floor has communal bathrooms and sinks, as well as shared kitchens, washers, and dryers. Each floor is overseen by one upper-class resident assistant, also known as RA, 
who is your go-to for any questions you may have and also serves as a peer mentor. When it comes to student life, there's so much to take advantage of outside of class. Whether it's an interest in dance, sports, politics, science, the environment, or even restaurants and board games, there's a club available to you. Annual traditions like Violet Pride, the Dumpling Festival, Orientation Week, and Ally Week give students a chance to sample new foods, make new friends, and acquire new perspectives on themselves and others. Beyond that, remember that you're still in one of the most dynamic and exciting cities in the world. In a place like Shanghai, you can immerse yourself in the stunning traditional neighborhoods with the most cutting edge architecture. Whether you're enjoying a concert with friends or trying out the various concept cafes around the city, as well as delicious foods from all over the world, you'll find that you'll never run out of things to do. In two years, we will be moving to a new campus, which broke ground in May 2019. That's right, we are building it from the ground up with our exact desire plans that current students also had a voice in designing. It'll allow us to grow to, to double our current capacity and just like with our current campus, our new campus will be equipped with state-of-the-art facilities such as classrooms, labs, lounges, an expansive library, a fitness center, cafeteria, and more. In addition to everything offered on campus, Keep in mind that we're also located at the heart of Shanghai's financial center. For those not familiar with Shanghai, it is an urban city with one of the easiest and most convenient public transportation systems anywhere. From our campus, you're only a few minutes away from major train stops that connects you to the rest of the city. This ease of access allows you to leverage different opportunities around the city that makes Shanghai itself an extension of our campus. Whether you're interning at one of the world-class financial institutions based here, or going on class trips to art galleries organized by professors to broaden your exposure to different elements of Chinese culture, you'll find that your education at NYU Shanghai is meant to help take advantage of all the opportunities found in a new setting. Our language instruction is in English. In fact, you do not need to know any Mandarin to apply. The majority of students who join start at the very beginning. Regardless of what your level is when you start, you can be sure that all students will be proficient in Mandarin by the time that they graduate. If you're just starting out, keep in mind that learning Mandarin in Shanghai gives you the ability to be immersed in the language. Whether you're at the grocery store, ordering at a restaurant, spending time with your Chinese friends, or meeting locals around the city or the country, you'll get to practice everything you learn in class whenever you want. For those who are more advanced, we have plenty of more advanced course offerings to help you practice what you know and perfect your Mandarin from the start. No matter what your level is when you come to NYU Shanghai, we will tailor your education to make sure you get the most out of the experience of studying a new language and culture. With the tight-knit community of our small liberal arts campus in Shanghai, you get a student to faculty ratio of seven to one, which means small average class sizes, more individualized attention, and access to some of the most accomplished faculty members in the world. At the same time, you also get to benefit from the access and resources offered by the large research institution that is NYU. In order to graduate, all students are required to complete our core curriculum. As you can see, there are various different disciplines included here, which will allow you to take a variety of classes that provide you with different perspectives and the ability to become a more well-rounded individual. The examples you see correspond to the types of classes you can take and not the actual classes themselves. So you have many options as to how you can fulfill your requirement and learn about what you find most interesting. A great example of this is our Global Perspectives on Society class, in which students engage in deep questions about what society is and what it can be by drawing from texts and ideas from Eastern and Western thought. Some other examples include from the algorithmic thinking requirement, Creative Coding Lab, uh, or from the Cultural Foundations requirement, Masters of Asian Cinema, or maybe even from the Social Foundations, 
food in Chinese history. Through our core curriculum, you'll develop critical and analytical skills, communication skills, and learn not just what to think, but rather how to think, which will ultimately inspire the creativity needed to be successful in the world you'll graduate into. At NYU Shanghai, students come as undecided and have two years to declare a major. You can choose from 19 different majors across a wide range from business to STEM majors, social sciences and humanities, and even a very unique major to our school known as Global China Studies, which explores the ways in which the world has impacted China and what China's role in the modern world is. There are also pre-med and pre-law offerings if you are interested in attending medical school and law school in the United States. Additionally, it is possible to declare a second major and have multiple minors, as well as designing your own major by drawing from different disciplines across NYU Shanghai and with the help of a faculty advisor. And speaking of faculty, with such a diverse faculty, including about a third of professors coming from China and the rest from all over the world. Having easy access to these incredible and diverse minds allows for unparalleled mentorship and research opportunities from the very beginning of your college experience. Remember that our small student to faculty ratio also means that all classes are being taught by full-time faculty members who expect to get to know their students and be mentorship figures to them through the network of professionals uh, as well as research. Students also have access to a wealth of research opportunities in any field and also have access to different funding sources on campus, such as the Dean's Undergraduate Research Fund or DERF, which grants students funding for summer research projects in any field, or access to the different research institutes and centers, such as our Center for Data Science and Artificial Intelligence or our Institute for Social Development. As a student at NYU Shanghai, you are part of a much larger network within the NYU family. From our three degree granting campuses in New York, Abu Dhabi, and Shanghai, to our 12 study away centers in places like Paris, Tel Aviv, Sydney, Buenos Aires, and more, you will be able to immerse yourself in yet another cultural setting during your time in college. In fact, all students at NYU Shanghai are required to study away for at least one semester and up to two in order to graduate. A huge benefit of being part of NYU's global network is that when you study away in our network, you are still at NYU. That means that since we own and operate all our sites, classes and faculty are all at NYU. You never need to worry about your credits transferring because they are meant for NYU classes. Additionally, your financial aid travels with you which means that whatever you're paying as an NYU Shanghai student is what you'll be paying when, you st when you're studying away at any of our study away sites. When studying away, you can even take advantage of your location by declaring a global network minor, which is specific to the site you're in, such as Latin American culture and society at NYU Buenos Aires. As mentioned earlier, you'll earn two degrees, a Bachelor of Arts or Bachelor of Science degree from NYU, which is the same degree across all three of our campuses, and a second degree from NYU Shanghai, which is a Chinese diploma certified by the Chinese Ministry of Education, giving you an extra edge to open up career opportunities around the world. We'll have one-on-one -on -one advising workshops on important work skills, and we'll even host career fairs. Your senior capstone project will tie in everything you learn as a student. And keep in mind that after you graduate, you'll be joining an incredible network of alumni, which include our very own NYU Shanghai alumni, as well as over 500,000 NYU alumni across 180 countries. You can find our graduates studying and working all over the world. In fact, 65% of graduates from the class of 2019 are living outside of their home countries with 14% of international graduates working or studying in China. 91% of the class is either working or pursuing advanced degrees. Along with the companies listed on the screen, 
we also have alums working at places like Google, JP Morgan, Adidas, as well as pursuing advanced degrees in places like Harvard, MIT, and Oxford. Our students are already making an impact in the world around them. If you want to see more, you can look for the Graduate Destinations Report on our website, which will detail what all of our graduated classes have done. Okay, now that I've given you an overview of our campus and programs, I wanna take the rest of the time to talk about our application and financial aid process. Since we receive so many applications from all over the world, I want to clarify that NYU Shanghai has two different application processes, one for Chinese applicants and one for non-Chinese applicants, which we refer to as the international application process. The process that I will outline is for the international students. So if you are a Chinese student, meaning a Chinese citizen who is tuning in today, please check out our website for details on the Chinese application process. When applying to NYU Shanghai, you will be using the Common Application, also known as the Common App, which is an application that many colleges and universities use across the United States. You will search for New York University and add us to your My Colleges list, which will allow you to complete the NYU portion of the Common App, including ranking your interest in one, two, or all three of our degree-granting campuses. When applying to NYU Shanghai, it is important to note that the most successful applicants will have picked Shanghai as their first choice campus. This is a very strong indicator of your interest in our campus, and it is something we take seriously into consideration. In the Common App, you'll fill out basic information questions about yourself and your family, you'll write an essay that will give us a sense of who you are, and you'll write an NYU-specific essay called the YNYU, where you'll talk about what specifically interests you about studying at NYU, and in our case, what interests you about NYU Shanghai. In addition to the common app, we will also need your high school transcript, standardized test scores, um, and by the way, NYU has a very unique standardized testing policy that allows students to submit any number of exams to meet our requirements, but we also recognize that the continued struggle with the COVID-19 health crisis has made it more difficult for applicants to take standardized tests. So while we still welcome you to submit test scores in line with our policy, we will not require it and you will not be disadvantaged during the application review process if you don't submit testing. Keep in mind that this updated testing policy is only for students who will be applying to NYU in the 2020-2021 application cycle. We'll also need one counselor evaluation and one teacher or instructor evaluation or recommendations. And if you are coming from a non-English speaking country or a non-English speaking curriculum, we'll need English language testing such as the TOEFL, IELTS, or any of the other tests we accept. It is important to note that we have three deadlines for first year applicants, early decision one, early decision two, and regular decision. With early decision one and two, you're finding out your decision earlier than most of your peers, and you're also committing to attending NYU Shanghai if admitted. With regular decision, you have more flexibility when applying. This isn't a binding commitment at all, which means that you have a chance to compare other admissions offers as well as financial aid packages. And speaking of financial aid, we are happy to say that we are able to provide financial aid to all of our students, regardless of their citizenship. The types of aid you can get at NYU Shanghai include merit-based aid, meaning scholarships that are purely based on your academic achievements, and need-based aid, which is purely based on your family's financial situation and can come in the form of grants, which is money you don't have to pay back, and loans, which you will eventually have to pay back after you graduate. Okay, so thank you so much for listening to me today. Before ending this presentation, I just want to say that I'm so impressed with all of you today. We know you can choose a school like many of your classmates, one that might be closer to home and a little more familiar, but you took a st step to engage with us here today, and that is really impressive. I look at the growth of our students, and after four years of being in an environment that challenges them to grow, learn, and actively lean in and engage with cultures, languages, perspectives that are all different from their own, 
they have expanded their comfort zones and have truly become comfortable anywhere. Please remember that we want to connect with you. Our website has the most up-to-date information and our social media accounts are active and always posting scenes from our campus and Shanghai, the city. So please follow if you want to stay in the loop with NYU Shanghai. You can also feel free to send us an email or give us a call and one of our admissions counselors will be happy to connect with you. Once again, thank you so much for taking the time to join us today. We hope to see you again soon.